I'm Sharon Bill. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I wanted to share a really, really happy morning with you. The story is, over lockdown, I was unable to teach one of my school pupils because he was in France and couldn't get back. And also his timetable in France meant that he couldn't fit into the usual school time slot, even though we were doing remote lessons. And so, you know, I want to uh, continue teaching. We wanted to make the best we could despite all of the obstacles. And so it's just like, well, let's rearrange a time and let's, let's do a bit of an extra lesson on a Thursday evening or, or whatever. And, you know, it was really great to just keep going no matter what. So, you know, thousands of miles didn't matter. Clashes in timetables didn't matter. It doesn't matter. We can just keep playing piano. And, it, you know, it's good for me as well. I was enjoying it. I would just hope that one day I can speak French because um, he is French. And uh, so he, he was here, but back in France. And so these lessons with Kilian, I was hoping might be an opportunity for me to uh, catch up on my French, but my French is just not good enough and you'd have no piano lesson at all if that were the case. So maybe one day. So we managed to sort of squeeze in a time and sort of, you know, rearrange things. And his mom was, you know, just so kind and so grateful and wanted to say thank you for just that small gesture. And she herself is an artist and so, so kindly wanted to give me one of her pieces of artwork. So, here it is. And she let me choose as well, which was even extra special. So here we have um, an acrylic sketch, uh, a painting of medieval stonework in Brittany. That's it, that's what she says. And, and I do love medieval architecture. And I am a bit of a sucker when it comes to gargoyles. I've got gargoyles in the hallway, actually. And so it was so lovely of her to give me this painting and I really, really love it. And, you know, it makes me so happy, not only because I like the painting, but I like the thought of, you know, the people behind it and the story behind it as well. But what was even extra special was when they could finally come back to England and we could finally meet up again and, and, I, and I could have the painting. We had such a lovely morning and I'm so grateful to them for the hospitality as well. So Anne uh, gave me the, her painting and it was lovely to see Killian and say hello again. And her partner David is also an artist and they were so, so welcoming and we had such a lovely morning chatting and it just really encouraged me because oftentimes in the arts it can be a little bit awkward with insecurities and kind of people being threatened and so on you know well because my husband's an artist and you're an artist well you know is he better than me or is he more successful than me it just happens in the arts you know it's the same in music and uh, and I know it is in drama and it isn't always the case but I know it can be sometimes and it was just so lovely to see different styles of art, you know, what my husband does, what David does, what Anne does, and the world's big enough for us all, the world's a big enough place. And then we got talking about YouTube and, you know, what you could do this and how, you know, how we've had to all adapt and change. And I could say, well, you know, I've been doing this and you could try this and what about this and think about this. And again, the world's big enough for us all. And it was just such a lovely morning. So we got the mutual, topics of um, music and art and also they got they were um, into motorbikes so we could have a nice chat about that because we've had motorbikes for you know quite a few years we've just uh, stopped actually because we did have a triumph bonville uh, but we haven't got that now so you know there was so much to talk about and in the end i just wrenched myself away because it's like you know i could be here all day if we just keep chatting and it, it just really came home to me um, that the tentacles of the music community as well, how they're sort of always interlocking and that community aspect. And if you've got something positive and good, pass it on, pass it on, let's say, encourage each other and help each other. And that's what's sort of the culmination this painting is of just last year was terrible for so many things. But, you know, we, if we all just kind of put ourselves out a little bit, We've kept going and it was just so lovely to celebrate that really. And, and interestingly, um, 
David's son was also a conductor in the orchestra that uh, my kids went to for years and years as they were growing up. So again, I kind of knew the family and they kind of knew our family. But to actually meet and have a chat and, you know, the hospitality and the warmth. And, and I just thought that's what this channel's about, isn't it? If I can just try and foster an attitude of community and encouragement. And, you know, there's so much that we've each got to give. And if we've got something positive and if we've got something that can help, put it out there, pass it on. And so thank you so much to Anne for the lovely painting. I, I really do love it. And thank you to Kilian for, you know, being such a lovely student. And thank you to Anne and David for their lovely hospitality. But also thank you to you because I'm so grateful for this opportunity for us to mutually engage and help each other. And we've all got this mutual love of pursuing the subject of music. And, and I'm just so grateful that although things have been tough in many ways, there have been a really load of such great encouragement as well and the world's a small place and so let's just embrace that so you know thank you so much pass it on thanks for watching bye